Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another talk video today. We've got a bit of Garden Warfare 2 random gameplay for you lovely people in the background. If you guys go ahead and enjoy it and you wish to see more videos like this, be sure to drop a like on it. Be sure to also subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never ever miss a video. Um, so yeah, today's topic is Garden Warfare 3. I know, I know, we've been through this topic how many times, but... I'm going to ask a very simple question. What would you do if Garden Warfare 3 came out tomorrow? Would you buy it? Would you not? What would you like to see in the game? Now, personally for me, like I said many times before, I don't think the PvZ shooter um, side of the franchise will expand anytime soon. Um, it kind of sucks to say that, because I think the game still has a lot more to offer. And, um, you know, playing Garden Warfare 2, Garden Warfare 1, and even Battle for Neighborville, I'm not going to, you know, discredit that. You know, it's still a PvG shooter, whether people like it or not. The thing is, with those three games, um, they've still got a lot of new people coming over to them. Um, obviously, I don't know about uh, Battle for Neighborville because I don't really play it, but I would imagine there's some sort of new people coming over to Battle for Neighborville still and playing it. Garden Warfare 2... Is still getting people. Garden Warfare One is still getting people, and it just makes me wonder, like, if I could go back to the glory days of Garden Warfare Two and Garden Warfare One, I, I definitely would, because it, you know, seeing the lobbies full of randomers does make you feel kind of good about the game, because you know, the game does deserve a long shelf life. There's still a lot more things, like I said earlier, that they can offer for Garden Warfare Three if it ever came out, um, and. I, you know, I think it is, the topic at this point is very washed up. Um, people saying the same thing over and over again. I don't think it's going to happen. Don't think it's going to happen. And to be fair, I kind of agree with them. Um, it does suck to say that, but you know what? I'm also keeping an open mind. You know, I don't know what is next for the PVZ franchise. I know they've done PVZ uh, 3 on the phone at one point. I don't know if that's still going on. Um, I don't know if BFN Switch is getting updated anymore. And, you know, I think Garden Warfare 3, you know, it, it just needs to be Garden Warfare 2. But with new maps, new character variants, maybe a new character and new game modes, you know. And, um, you know, personally for me, I would like to see um, a mixture of all three games together. So, like I said before, I, would, I like BFN's costumes i think the costumes and the customizations in bfm were good the maps were all right as well the character design was a little bit off garden warfare 2's gameplay was fantastic uh bfn's story mode was great and then garden warfare 1's nostalgia you know classic game modes classic maps and customizations and that like in my opinion and of course, let me know what you lot think down in the comment section below. I will be reading the comments. I'm excited to see what you lot have to say. Um, in my opinion, I think, you know, if you just take the good things out of all three games and put them together and then add whatever else you want on top, which is which will make the game run smoother, look better, feel better as well. We could have Garden Warfare 3 on our hands. Now, at this point, I don't think PopCap are going to do anything. But I've seen, believe it or not, I've actually seen people do Garden Warfare 2 mods on PC. I've seen a few videos about it, and it got me thinking about Garden Warfare 3. It made me wonder, imagine if it did come out. Imagine right now you're downloading a game, you pre-ordered it, you get a special new character, there's loads of new game modes, everyone's level 1 again. Nobody knows what characters are good, what ones are bad. You know, and I think the good thing is about the game if it ever to come out is I think it kind of guarantees a good start um, it depends on the game itself because if it's anything like Garden Warfare 2 or Garden Warfare 1 then I think the game would be a really good success but if it's anything like BFN and how that got brought out I don't think it would last very long so the thing is with, with the whole Garden Warfare 3 topic um, goes back to my original point I think you know, we actually have people out there that make games. And, for example, there was a long time ago, this is a bit off topic here, but a long time ago I saw a GTA uh, Vice City mod 
for GTA 5, and that was made by someone random. Um, shout out to them, whoever done it. But yeah, they made it, and it looked stunning. Oh my goodness! I tell you what, people, it was amazing. The the graphics were great. The the way it felt, the way it moved, the way it sounded. The mod for Vice City on GTA 5 looks amazing. And then Rockstar came out and brought out the GTA 5 Remastered Trilogy. And it didn't do as well people thought it would. And it just got me thinking, imagine if someone done that for Garden Warfare 3. You know? Imagine if we just went, you know what? Flip it. Let's, let's make the game ourselves, you know? Because there are people out there that can make games like this. And mods and... I've seen it on Garden Warfare 2 mods as well. There's a lot of new variant characters and a lot of new ideas people are still coming up with and new game modes and new maps. It's it's incredible. And it really does make you think, what happens if Garden Warfare 3 doesn't get made by PopCap? Like, it doesn't have to be made by them. It could be, uh, like, made by someone else, you know? And the problem is, a lot of people, you know, blame EA for it because, obviously, EA are part of the franchise and a lot of people tend to blame them etc and to be fair you guys are not wrong for doing that um you know i do think they are partly to blame um but you know it really does make me think like what happens if garden warfare 3 ever became an actual game an actual playable thing like it doesn't have to be made by popcap like someone could make a a, a massive mod kind of like GTA Vice City one I mentioned and just update the characters in Garden Warfare 2 with new customization, a new map showcase maybe you know, there are people out there that do this stuff and it just got me thinking like imagine if it actually did happen but as always let me know what you think down in the, in the comment section below, if Garden Warfare 3 came out, do you want it to be made by PopCap or do you want it to be made by someone else? Or do you want EA to leave the franchise? Do you want them to stay? I'm a bit 50-50 on the situation. Um, I think PopCap would be involved in the project, 100%. But I feel like the actual main person, you know, should have full credit for the, for the thing that they created. So let me know what you guys think. I personally think there's a lot of space for Garden Warfare 3 still. Um, again, I know the topic is, is topic is washed up at this point. Not many people are playing Garden Warfare 2. A lot of people are getting bored, and you know what? I can understand why. Because, you know, it's the same people, the same things, same game mode, same maps, every single day. And, um, you know, it is totally understandable, you know? We've been playing Garden Warfare 2 for how long? Uh, it's the same with you BFN people and you Garden Warfare 1 people, you know? You, you've got to remember how long you've been playing it for. And um, it is a long time. You know, it is, it is a long time that we've been playing these games for and uh, just sit there for a minute and wonder what happens if it ever did come out. But personally, you never know. Um, I like to keep my mind open about these kind of sub uh, subjects. I like to make sure my, my mind is open for other ideas and stuff like that. And um, in terms of what PopCap are doing at the moment, I have no idea. They, I have no idea if they're updating any of the other games they're doing. You know, PBZ Heroes, PBZ 3... Um, I know they were doing um, uh, another game at one point as well. I don't know what they're doing. But in terms of Garden Warfare 3 itself, I think there's still a lot of things that can be done to make it happen and to make it semi-decent game, uh, to actually be created. Um, we've seen people make mods for Garden Warfare 2. They've been absolutely incredible. And, um, you know, it just shows you that we do have people out there that do that kind of stuff and that are good at it. So... I don't know. It is a very weird topic to talk about. Um, I feel like there's a lot of new character ideas that are still getting thrown around. Um, there's still a lot of new maps that could be created. There's still a lot of old maps that could be reintroduced but updated. You know, there's customizations. There's a new story mode. There's just a lot of stuff. And um, I'm just saying, you never know. But let me know what you guys think about this topic in the comment section below. If you did enjoy, let me know what you think. As always, do you think it will ever come out? Do you think it will ever be made? Not necessarily by PopCap, but could it be made by someone else? You never know. So, I will see you lot tomorrow. Be sure to let me know what you think in the comment section. And I'll catch you guys in a bit. Take care. Have a good rest of your day. And I'll see you lot later.